In a world exclusive, I am bringing you this very latest model from Selma Paris. This is a 100th anniversary saxophone from Selma. It is called the Model 2022, and it's literally celebrating 100 years of history within the Selma factory. 100 years of music, 100 years of, of wonderful saxophones. <laughs> So if we think back 100 years to their first model, it was literally called the Model 22, and this is now the Model 2022, very clever. And what they're doing here is giving us a Supreme, of course the latest uh, release from Selma in the last year or so, and adding a whole lot more to the Supreme. So um, I'm just delighted to be in a position where we've received the first one in the world, I believe, and I'm showcasing it right here in the London store for you now. Selma have made a limited run of 641 pieces of this and you may be wondering why that specific number. It's because there are precisely 641 working parts on this saxophone. So we are going to try and attain as many of those saxophones that we can here at sax.co but no promises on the final number there. Now, the first thing that strikes me when I look at this saxophone is the beautiful lacquer. It's quite different from their other Supreme finishes. It's got this lovely shine to it. It's obviously a matte lacquer, um, but it's a matte lacquer with a difference. It's got a real sophistication to it, and it, and it really stands out to me as I'm looking at one right now. It looks slightly different from when I was looking at just at the computer imagery um, prior to this turning up. <laughs> It looks stunning in the flesh, as I say, and contrasting beautifully with this black finishing here. It's, it's kind of got a, a matte look to it. It's not just any old standard black. They have pulled out all the stops, and it is a lovely bespoke black finishing touch on these key guards here, 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 and then on the reverse of the sax as well. And here we see a gold-plated brace which connects the bell to the body, and I believe this references microphones used in the 1920s. Um, so they're really thinking this through, Selma, and t talking of the 1920s, and we have this Art Deco style engraving on the back, which is simply stunning. Um, and we can see featuring here uh, the Montmartre, um, the Eiffel Tower. We've got a Ferris wheel there on the Seine. Um, it, yeah, the, the whole thing is just absolutely stunning. Whilst I've got it on this side angle, I can see more evidence of black because the, the pads are in fact a black leather um, with gold style wavy reflectors on them, which uh, again matches the, the nice sort of gold aesthetic on the outside. And talking of gold, it has a gold plated um, crimping um, ring up here and the thumb rests right and left-handed are also gold-plated, so no expense spared there. So just a beautiful saxophone overall, based on the Supreme, um, but it's a very special limited Supreme. I'm sure the kind of person who would go for this saxophone is interested in pure Selma history because that's what it represents. When there's only 641 of these things, guys, you want to grab one of these things.